In a matter of hours, we'll learn if Arizona teachers have voted to walk out of their classrooms. In a vote held by Arizona Educators United, teachers decided what day and how long the walkout would be. Cronkite News reporter Megan Myers spoke with Valley teachers about their support of this movement. We are going to act as one body, as far across the state as we possibly can, to, act, to remain united and do this as one. Peoria teacher Melissa Germscheid is just one of the many Arizona educators ready to take a stand and walk out over school funding. Several school districts have released contingency plans to parents. Many hoped a shutdown won't happen. Germscheid assures parents that regardless of tonight's vote, her students will remain her top priority. In every teacher's mind, it's all about our kids. What about our kids? What are our kids going to do that day? We would never. We would never physically walk out on them, leave them alone, or not give parents notice. The Red for Ed movement has been going strong for nearly five weeks, and teachers say the governor's 20% raise proposal does not help the needs of all educators, including counselors, specialists, and even textbooks and building maintenance. One Valley parent says teachers are offering a good lesson. The things that our kids are learning about in their history books are coming to life right before them, that they can be a part of that, that their teachers are a part of that, that they're witnessing something that could be um, potentially huge as far as how things get changed in a better direction for our state. Results of the walkout vote are expected by 8 tonight. In Phoenix, Megan Meyer, Cronkite News.